hello friends today we will discuss on the topic composite materials unit number 5 testing inspection and standards in the composites i am dr arjit pawar from ethnd college of engineering and research center yola lastly in the unit 5 we learn the mechanical and uh, physical properties an environmental test of the composite material today just we take the overview of the mechanical and physical properties some properties not we are in last lecture similar to all the properties today we discuss only one two properties and the, what are the mechanical and what are the physical a need to improve the mechanical property of polymer drive the development of the glass fiber when composed of polymers and the first composite parts to be used for zada domes boat hulls and car boat car body section through the frustration or vacuum by molding these are the first one also the composite express a mechanical behavior significantly different from the that of the conventional mat- uh, materials such as metals owing to their nature therefore are the standard designer for the directly evaluating the bulk mechanical properties of composites are usually preferred for tin side compressive and shear trade composites material especially lightweight composite structures are being used in an ever increasing variety of products and applications such as aeroplane construction ground transportation and environmentally sustainable energy system that inverts immensely needs mechanical and physical testing of the component and structures of the composite materials prior their applications thus the full characteristics of the properties of anisotropic and inhomogeneous composite materials for use in the demanding structural applications require a wide range of the mechanical test the mechanical testing of composites materials in all a range test of the types and felstock of standards astm iso cen along with testing conditions in the variety of different environment the mechanical and physical properties are testing of the polymers and their composites is vital of the determine the material properties for use in the design and analysis of the product quality also quality control application performance requirements and production processes the mechanical and physical testing ensure the mechanical material com- uh, conditions also the material compliance with the performance requirement in accordance with industrial specifications especially to the aerospace automotive consumer medical and defense industries mechanical testing of polymer composite in all the determination of mechanical parameters such as strength and thickness of investigate its use for the design of composite structure the most common standard drive mechanical testing of polymer composite includes tensile means tension flexural impact shear and compressive with open and closed holes and the physical testing includes water absorption density void contents block contents hardness and stress resistance researchers are also conducted some compression shear and interlaminar strain for the determination of the proper parameters of the like uh, failure criteria model involving ultimate stress and failure predicted of the complete sample this show in the we have so here uh, given the website on this you search every materials related to physical mechanical testing aacr research dot at in the mechanisms behind is many other standards bearing strength test according to astmd 5961 and interlaminar fracture toughness test to the ASTM D5538 are reported as a mechanical test on the composites. In mechanical, they are one of the tensile stress is carried out. The tensile testing is a destructive type process that provides information about the tensile strength, held stress, 
ductile jadi metallic property uh, material it measures the force required to break a composites or plastic specimen and the extent to which the specimen stretches or elongate to the breaking points tensile stretching of composites is generally in the form of basis tension of flat sandwich tension testing in accordance with standard such as iso 527 ISO 5274 5 ISTM D638 ISTM D3039 and ISTM C297 such test produces stress strain diagram used to determine tensile modulus tensile stress testing is presented in next figure C this is the tensile stress for the plastic of composite materials as shown here then alignment is critical for composite testing application because components are anisotropic and generally brittle as the anisotropy means that the properties and strength of the material differ depending on the direction of the applied force or load thus the tensile strength of the composite materials is very high in the direction parallel to the fiber orientation while the tensile stress is much lower if tested in any other direction interestingly to determine maximum tensile strength in the direction parallel to the fiber direction the tensile stress must have superior axial load string alignment primarily critical in aerospace industry where composites are often applied in the high tensile stress structure currently a range of proven gripping mechanism includes manual pneumatic and hydraulic actuation is available for ambient sub ambient and high temperature testing ranging between 269 and 600 then number second is the physical testing in which one of the water absorption this is called water absorption 24 hours equilibrium is the most important physical test for the material to be used for exterior application under the ASTM D570 it is used to determine the amount of water absorbed under specified conditions factor affecting water absorption behavior includes the type of plastic additives used at temperature and length of the exposure the results obtained give an insight on the performance of the materials in water or humid environments percentage of water absorption was calculated from the equation also absorption t water absorption in the percentage wn minus wd divided by wd multiplied by 100 where wn is the weight of composite sample or after the emulsion and wd is the weight of the composite sample before the emulsion after and before the emulsion for the water absorption t the specimen size drive is an o1 for the specified times and temperature and then placed in a distillator to cool immediately upon cooling the specimen are wetted the material is then immersed immersed in water at agreed under condition upon 23 degree to 24 hours or until uh, un upper equilibrium and then removed patted patted dry with lint free cloth and wetted carefully the water absorption stage is expressed as an increase in weight percentage and continuous for several days until the constant weight of the sample is to be obtained second one physical which are the density density is one of the important factor in determining the property of polymer composite materials and defined as mass the mass of material per unit volume measured as standard astm d729 to 725 ASTM D792291 in the case of fiber reinforced polymers composites its value mainly depends on the relative propagation of the reinforcement and matrix the density of composite constituents fiber and matrix is determined by weighing the specimen in air and then weighing it while suspended on wire and immersed uh, and immersed in the water and the difference in water is noted in the in the case of the specimen having the density lower than that of water 
a sprinkler is allowed allowed to attach with wire facilitator immersion the density is low is then calculated rho is equal to 0.9975 multiplied by a divided by a plus w minus b where a is the weight of pcman in air b is the total weight of the pcman and sinkers completely immersed while the wire is partially immersed and w is equal to the weight of a fully immersed sinker but partially immersed wire the density of the composite is also determined in the similar way in some cases composite density is measured by using astm d 1895 standard calculated by using density gram per centimeter cube is equal to mv where m is the mass of the composite and v is equal to volume of the composite thank you friends